Oh my god! Not a very big fish, but he inhaled that revolver. Wow. Not a big fish at all, but first one on the... Second fish on the, don't hook me, second fish on the Guggen Squad revolver. That was cool. <clears throat> Skinny fish, but they fight hard too. I gotta, I gotta talk about what I'm doing. I've always been a fan of the river to see Whopper Plopper. And I know that they came out with the revolver, so I picked it up, I kind of been wanting to throw it. And what I like about it is I like that the fin is in the middle of the bait and it sits flat in the water. See how it sits flat like that? The only thing that I don't like about this topwater bait is that sometimes the hooks will get tangled together. But other than that, so far it's pretty solid. I do have it with a uh, a Shimano Cronarch CI4 Plus 761, which is 36 inches per turn. I have a seven foot two medium heavy power fast action. On the package, it says the bait is, is a half ounce, but I feel like it's a little heavier than that. Or maybe it is just a half ounce, but it works really good on this medium heavy. That first fish startled me and then I got a second one and here's the third one. They fight hard in this pond. That looks better than the first two. Hook just how I like it for a topwater too. Another maybe high one pound, maybe like a 113 two pound, but nice summer bass, man, on the topwater. I'm gonna have to keep fishing it and like test the durability. Hopefully I can catch a big bass today, but. And remember too, like all of my fishing is done at public lakes and highly pressured lakes. So anytime I get to come out to a pond like this, it's more of a treat to me. I know that I can take a plastic or a top water or whatever it may be, I'm probably gonna catch fish. Just standing off the dock right now. Supposed to take the the canoe or the boat out in a bit. You'll notice the pop, the, the plopping. I almost said the popping, the plopping on the bait. is loud and I like it a lot. <laughs>
just another one. All small fish today, but definitely gonna get a decent video. They like that top water. See, I haven't fished a top water walking bait or a plopper style bait in I think three years, but like I get comments on my channel. People are like, why don't you fish top water? Or why don't you throw a frog and all this? I do. I just haven't done it in forever. So you got what? Four small fish. Haven't missed a bite yet. Guggen Squad revolver. I don't know if it's gonna replace my Whopper Plopper 130 that I love, but so far so good. And like I said, it is a pond. So like I said, it's more of a treat than anything because i don't know that i'm gonna catch fish but i'm pretty sure you can come out here and catch some And fishing on the bottom. That was a bite, wasn't it? Got him. That's a good fish. Not as good as I thought, but uh, skinny. Thought he was a lot bigger, but. Oh yeah, look at that. <laughs> so you got four fish on the revolver. Now you got one on the bandito bug. Oh. What is that? Oh, a bass ate my bluegill, dude. What? A bass ate my bluegill and I was just reeling in. Is that a good one? I'm not even kidding. Bass ate my bluegill, bro. Oh, that looks like a good one. Dude, he just spit up the bluegill. Get him. Get him, brother. Oh. Get him, get him, get him. <laughs> No way. Dude, I watched him spit up the bluegill as you were reeling it in. Watch this. Look at how perfectly you had it hooked. With your, yeah, look at it. It's number two. That's the biggest bass of the day. <laughs> wow. Here. Go ahead and turn on the scale. We're gonna zero it. I'm gonna go ahead and say, I don't know, two pounds, 10 ounces. You're pretty good on your weight, but I gotta give you that. That's two pounds. I knew I'd be off. Two pounds, five ounces. Two pounds, five ounces. Give me my fish. Hold on. This fish ate my bluegill. Incredible. We gotta let her go. Alright. Did I just get bit?
Oh, that was cool. After you caught that bass on the bluegill, that's when I decided to throw a thunder cricket. Skinny fish, but and I don't have my rod for a moving bait. I do have a I got that heavy for a bottom bait, but it'll have to do. It's got 20 pound on it. They were hitting the top water and they didn't really, and then they they quit wanting the top water and and the Texas rig, and then I saw them catch that bluegill and I said, okay. That's all I need to see. <laughs> 